TC, I have some potential, potentially exciting news. Warner Brothers Discovery to create new Lord of the Rings films that will honor the past, look to the future, and adhere to the strongest levels of quality. Um, I don't know if I'm excited about this one. <laughs> it would depend on what they did. Yeah, I. And they already. So here, they already. The thing is, they already have a masterpiece of a trilogy. And they, they do. have to to the prequels. So all the fuck is their sequel trilogy. So. I don't know. Yeah, I. So we'll put the article link in the description box below. We won't go through the entire thing, but uh, it does uh, read that Zafloff today. He stated today, I'm thrilled to announce that Mike DeLuca and Pam Edibai signed a deal to make multiple Lord of the Rings movies. Lord of the Ring is one of the most iconic storytelling franchises. Okay, yeah, we know that. Nothing in this article refer to Peter Jackson working on these movies at all. And I know it was Peter Jackson's touch and his respect for Tolkien that even made these movies. He respected the lore in the source material. And I feel as though, I feel as though they are not going to do that this time around. I don't know. It's just a feeling. Maybe I'm wrong. I probably, maybe I am. I don't know. But the way things are nowadays with directors and companies, uh, they're making things for modern audiences, you know, having everybody in every character, having their personalities and content. I like diversity and inclusion is like a real strong thing these days and I think they're just gonna throw all of that bullshit into these but maybe I'm wrong <laughs> well we I would love I would love that just because I'd love to see you like audition as Aragorn. That'd be funny as hell. <laughs> um, why I can't? Why can't I audition to be Gandalf? Why can't I audition to be Gandalf? <laughs> I could. I'd see that. I could see. It. I got the. Barber. Fuck it. Race swap them. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, go ahead. <laughs> the one the one thing I did I I've, I've read about this from other outlets. And it sounds like Peter Jackson like he's not locked in or anything, but sounds like he's aware of what's going on. So maybe they'll go talk to him. And if they do and they give him the freedom to do the do right by the source material. I at least the possibility exists that it could be good. Correct. Yeah. Um, I also heard about that too. I think I read that as well on Twitter that he is aware of uh, their interest in doing this. And I hope that they bring him on or at least discuss things with him because I would feel a lot better. I would feel a lot better about the direction that these movies are gonna that these movies are gonna head in. Unlike that disaster we know called Rings of Power, that he was supposed to be consulted on, and then they completely ghosted him. I, and we, my, uh, my, mm -hmm. What rights does Warner Discovery and New Line or whatever have? What what rights do they have? What do they have access to? I think they have access to a lot. I think they have the Silmarillion. I think they have 
like a Like they have, I, a think, lot. I mean, they have the, the 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 whole damn trilogy on here. So, I mean, I could see them. You know, what would be hysterical and would make me laugh, laugh my ass off is if they made Lord of the Rings: The Second Age and just totally roasted the Rings of Power. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> that would be great. Well, they- I honest, I honestly think that they are gonna roast the rings of power in some way, because Amazon, I think Amazon only has like this much that they even own right now. It's not even, like it's like barely cracking, barely cracking the books. Right. Like, so I, I my think understanding is it's the, it's the original trilogy or and the appendices, right? And I right. think I'm hoping that they have like. I would love this. Well, I think it'd be interesting to see a Silmarillion movie. No, I agree. Or, or I agree. trilogy. I don't know. Or trilogy. Yeah. Or they could, like I said, just do the second age and do it so much better than Rings of Power to the point where it just completely takes it over in the cultural. <laughs> Although, outside of the memes, who actually talks about Rings of Power anymore? Exactly. I, you rarely hear about Rings of Power. If I do see anything related to that, it's usually an article that's talking about how things that we, you know, how the director wanted to do this, you know, them throwing people under the bus, them calling out fans, trolling the fans. I mean, it's the same old story. If fans are racist, that's, you know, same old shit. It's nothing positive. I can tell you that. That's, it's, I, I never read anything positive about Rings of Power. Well, it'd be kind of hard to. It'd be a hard yeah. sell. <laughs> oh, I really... I don't know. I was like, oh, okay, well, I guess we'll see. I guess we'll see. <sighs> I'm hoping that they put even if they put even a quarter of the care that they put into the original Lord of the Rings trilogy into any of these movies, it will roast anything made in the last decade. Yeah. (laughs) Yes, it will. And dude, I'm here for it. I'm here for it. We are due for some good fucking content. We are due for some good content, man. Yeah. Well, there's always the flash. (laughs) God damn it, Warner Brothers. What is going on? (laughs) Oh, man. You know the funny thing is? Even my brother was like, wow, the flesh looks awful. Wow. I know you guys, you guys out there don't really know his brother like that. But if you did, you'd be like, damn. <laughs> <laughs> if his brother says it's awful, it's it's fucking awful. <laughs> like it's awful. So and his brother's pretty lenient and you know he enjoys a lot of the Marvel stuff. So if he's coming out and saying that, then yeah, you know it's rough. You know, you know it's not good. But uh, my, my brother enjoys just having a good time at the movies. But yeah, he did not look very. He wasn't very happy with the Flash in his trailer. What's an interest, huh? Uh, I I love it. <laughs> I love it. Oh man. Well, TC, do you have any any last remarks about this article? Well, um, I'm trying to think of a Lord of the Rings pun, but most of the Lord of the Rings puns I know um, are about destroying it, which I don't necessarily want to do yet. So this will be one of those things we'll have to we'll have to wait and and see how it develops. <laughs> yeah, could it hit the point? Could it hit that point? Absolutely. Has it hit that point yet? Not yet. Not yet. 
just don't bring on any Marvel writers and you'll be in good shape. So no Marvel or CW writers. So you'll be in We've good got shape. another article in a couple of days probably coming out. We're, we've got something to say about that. But we need an agent of chaos for that one. Yeah, we do. We need AOC. The true AOC. <laughs> We got to get them back. You know, we'll be reaching our 100th episode pretty soon here. I'm thinking maybe we do a we do a Lord of the Rings. We talk about Lord of the Rings, the the, the trilogy. You know, maybe we'll do I'm that. I'm game for that. Right. I just finished it um, last week or the week before. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm game for that. All right. I'm going to rewatch them because they're freaking awesome. So... Uh yeah, we'll 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 uh we'll do we'll do a, sh- a show our 100 episode on it. It'll be good. To, it'll be good. I can't believe we're already to 100 episodes. I know, right? <laughs> and the thing when we started October of last year, it was like the toward the end of the year, and uh, already hitting 100. So definitely, we're serious about this. We definitely thank you guys for subscribing for sure and sticking it out with us. And thank yeah. you guys so much. We really appreciate it. We are truly, we are truly honored and we thank you. So, but again, we thank you guys for tuning in. Smash that like button. So please subscribe, share this video out there, hit that bell for notifications, leave a comment and let us know what you guys think. You guys take care. Have a good one, everybody.